We move on with other stories, and there's been massive turnout in the ongoing EC registration exercise in the Bono East region, with safety COVID-19 protocols being adhered to, with the exception of social distancing protocols. Join us checks in most of the constituencies reveal more work needs to be done with regards to social distancing to avert any possible community spread of the disease. Anna Sabit has been engaging some leaders in the region and has filed this report on day two of the exercise. Day two of the Electoral Commission's new voter registration exercise started slowly in most parts of the Bono East region due to early morning showers. Registrants, however, defied the rains to join the queues in their quest to get their voter ID cards. Whilst the use of the nose mask and the adherence to the hand washing protocols were strictly observed in most areas, social distancing protocols were poorly observed at the various registration centers. Deputy Minister for Regional Reorganization and Development and Parliamentary Candidate for the New Patriotic Party in the Techiman South constituency, Martin Ajay Mensakosa, tells Joy News that more work needs to be done in order to observe the safety COVID-19 protocols. So far, it's been very smooth, very peaceful, except for some occasional delays. Otherwise, there's been peace, there's order. Uh, with regards to the protocols, it looks like there's still some work to do. I have visited since yesterday all the 20 centers in Techiman. In some few places, it was okay. But in other places, people still have to do a bit of distancing. Though impressed with the conduct of the exercise, Mr. Ajay Mensakosa called on the people to stick to the protocols in order to minimize the spread of the pandemic. You can see, even here, some people are not wearing it or do draw it uh, to their chin. But uh, we need to keep enforcing it so that people can be safe and avoid the spread of this pandemic. In the Kintampo North constituency, the situation isn't different. We met the municipal chief executive and parliamentary candidate for the new patriotic party, Michael Sakwadi Bafo, in a monitoring tour of the exercise. He tells me the exercise has been largely peaceful, even though Kintampo North was once seen as a flashpoint during similar registration exercises. I haven't heard anything from the police. I haven't had any... Um, a report also from the monitoring team and so I think relatively uh, the exercise is peaceful and the patronage is also okay people are patronizing it I think this is the most peaceful registration exercise ever in Kintampo you know this place has always been it's a, one of the flashpoints that for this particular one this particular season I think everything is going on smoothly. We also spotted Mr. Adujan, who is the Director General of the Kofi Annan Center of Excellence in ICT. He disclosed to Joy News that the exercise has been one of the best so far as the voter registration is concerned. In the past, we've had situations in which, in the middle of it, they will say, oh, papers are jammed, we need ink, we need this to print. Um, for the uh, three constituencies that we have visited, we've never come encountered that issue it's going on smoothly the printing machines are going on fine the biometric machines are all functioning as clearly defined by ec so i'm very much satisfied with the technology that we have deployed for this exercise he added that the collaboration between the two major political parties devoid of vigilantism is something worth commendation when i go i look for both mpp and NDC agents to see how they are collaborating and they are working together. And so far, I see some kind of good relationship that after all, we are one people. And that is what I've observed. Uh, we don't have that vigilantism. Um, wherever we go, I ask the security, have there been any security breaches? All what they tell me is that no. So far as security is concerned, there hasn't been any breaches. In all, the exercise has been generally peaceful and with four more days to end the phase one. We hope that the exercise will see some massive improvements, especially with regards to the COVID-19 protocols. Reporting for Joy News, Anas Sabit, Kintampo.
Right, and that was Anna Sabit bringing us the latest from the Bono East region, i.e. Kintan Point. This is where we draw the curtains on this bulletin of Joy News Desk. My name is Daniel Dazi. I'll be back at midday to bring you Joy News today. See you then.